analysis of differentially expressed gene in wheat during Paxinia triticina infection. Wheat is the second major food crop in the world belongs to the family Poaceae, originated from Southwest Asia. Wheat is mainly affected by rust diseases caused by fungal pathogen. There are three types of rust, namely black rust or stem rust, yellow rust or stripe rust, and brown rust or leaf rust. Among these three, leaf rust causes more yield loss by reducing photosynthesis and kernel weight. Leaf rust caused by Paxinia triticina has many races, of which race 77 play a major role in causing leaf rust. And it possesses 12 biotypes. LR28 gene shows resistant to the biotype 77. So far, 47 leaf rust genes have been cloned and characterized. Identification of transcript derived fragments includes following steps. Pathogen inoculation, RNA isolation, cDNA synthesis, cDNA RAPD analysis. For inoculation of rust pathogen, 10 days old seedlings are selected. Water has to be sprinkled to the seedling to maintain the moisture. If second leaves of the seedlings are big, remove them by pinching. Then scrap the rust spores by lancet needle and apply uniformly in all the leaves of the seedling. After inoculation of the spores, spray the water on the seedlings to keep the moisture at high level. Then place the inoculated seedlings inside the moist chamber. After pathogen inoculation, the seedlings starts develop the rust infection. Then infected leaf samples are collected. Samples are ground with liquid nitrogen. Transfer the ground samples into a pond of tube and add 1 ml of trisol solution and vortex the mixture for proper mixing. Centrifuge the sample at 12,000 rpm for 15 minutes. Then collect the supernatant in fresh append of tube. And add 200 microliter of chloroform, again vortex and incubate at room temperature for 5 minutes. Again centrifuge and collect the supernatant. Add ice cold propanol 500 microliter and centrifuge and collect the pellet. Then wash the pellet with 75% ethanol. Then RNA is dissolved in nucleus free water and stored at minus 18 degrees centigrade. See DNA synthesis by fermenta skid. Add 3 microliter of RNA to prepare the reaction mixture. Then add 1 microliter of oligo DT primers. And add 8 microliter of nucleus free water and keep it in water bath at 65 degrees centigrade for 5 minutes. Likewise, add 1 microliter of RNAs incubators, 2 microliter of DNTPs mix, 4 microliter of reaction buffer, and 1 microliter of reverse transcriptase. Incubate at 42 degrees centigrade for 1 hour and terminate the reaction for 72 degrees centigrade for 5 minutes. cDNA RAPD Analysis Each reaction contains 1x PCR buffer. This buffer contains 10 micromolar Tris HCl at the pH of 8.3. 50 micromolar KCl and 1.5 micromolar MgCl2. And 12 nanogram of first tan cDNA. And 0.2 micromolar of DNTPs.
and 0.3 unit of tag DNA polymerase and 0.2 micromolar of primers. Here the PCR profile is initial denaturation at 92 degrees centigrade for 2 minutes, denaturation at 92 degrees centigrade for 1 minute, annealing at 37 degrees centigrade for 1 minute, extension at 72 degrees centigrade for 1 minute and final extension at 72 degrees centigrade for 5 minutes. The product of cDNA RAPD PCR reaction were resolved on 6% urea polyacrylamide gel at 3000 volt 100 volt constantly for 2 hours. Gel was stained using silver nitrate. Differentially expressed bands were identified in the silver stain paid gel. As a result, the comparison of amplification pattern between the resistant and susceptible cDNA sample using RAPD primers indicates the differential expression of 88 transcription derived fragments and some of them were common to both the samples. The size of the transcript derived fragments were range between 100 to 900 base pairs and most of them were expressed after 96 hours of pathogen inoculation. Then the transcript derived fragments were eluted using agarose gel and go for sequencing. 21 differentially transcript derived fragments were cloned into a vector and transformed into equally strain DH5-alpha using calcium chloride treatment. The recombinant Colonies were picked randomly and cultured overnight in 5 ml of LB broth containing ampicillin and then the plasmids were isolated. Sequencing of transcript derived fragments were done by Sanger method by using M13 primers and denoted as TATNAU1221. Sequence analysis Vector sequence was removed by VEX screen tool. TDF sequences were translated into amino acid sequence in single frame using TRANSIC program. BLAST-X sequences similarity search for 21 TDF sequences was performed against GenBank. Based on similarity search of differentially expressed transcripts against non-redundant protein database, we found out the transcripts are involved in transcription factors, biotic stress, structural protein, abiotic stress related protein, growth and development, metabolism and transport, plant defense signaling.